Hey, y'all ever seen a $1,500 weed eater? Well, all right, y'all, if you can tell from the intro, uh, yeah, and then the previous little clip of just kind of a, a looking at this thing, um, I had no idea that steel was this serious. Um, as you can tell, um, that is an FS561C. Um, comes with a, what looks to be a 10 inch uh, brush blade on the end of it. Um, and according to my local dealer back there, uh, that is a $1,500 weed eater. Uh, well, brush cutter. We'll call it a brush cutter because that that doesn't need, that can't classify as a weed eater. Uh, if your weeds look like something that that needs to cut, you don't have weeds. You have trees. Uh, but I thought it was really really cool when I saw it. I was like, what in the world? The the shaft on that thing has got to be an inch and a quarter to an inch and a half. Uh, so that thing has got to just be sheer nasty. Um, they said that somebody had purchased it or ordered it that does uh, timber. So I'm guessing they're using it for uh, underbrush, clearing out underbrush and stuff like that. Um, they could probably saw down a couple of trees with it. But um, just some little short video here, like I say. Um, let me know your thoughts on that. Uh, what y'all think about it? Uh, did y'all know that that was out there? Um, and so, yeah, crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, so today is, it's not currently raining, but it has been raining most of the day. Um, and the radar shows some coming back in. So it's uh, basically going to be a rain out day. Um, I've already contacted the two customers I was going to try to do this afternoon for that uh, because they're in prime rain territory. And I uh, got thumbs up from both of them. So it's supposed to be clear. Um, after about 7 or 7 30 and uh, overnight and tomorrow is supposed to be clear so uh, that'll give it a little time to dry out this evening and in the morning I've got a couple other properties to try to get to so for that um, that's the plan for tomorrow I've got to actually go back to the cemetery also and pick up or not pick up finish up uh, trimming on um, that that property where I was mowing in the previous video so all the mowing's done um, I've gotten some good feedback on the last video about the cut quality difference on the um, quick track and the Z track so um, I'm also running different blades on those also but I'm gonna change up the ones on the quick track um, Got a comment from, or two comments from over at uh, American Lawn Specialist. So again, y'all check them out. Shout out to them. Uh, husband and wife team over there knocking it out with the uh, Bobcat stand-on mowers. They did some, some really good work. So um, I just seen a video come through the feed. It's an older video where he talks about uh, Bahia grass a little bit. So I, I want to watch that one because... Uh, if y'all watched my channel for a while, y'all know I deal with plenty of it. So, um, and then I've got a couple other properties to try to get to um, tomorrow as well. So trimming that one out, and then uh, I had originally that, and th I had three properties on the schedule. So now I'm going to have five along with the trimming at the cemetery. So I'm going to try to get down to the cemetery. Um, somewhat first thing in the morning and get through there and get it trimmed out before it gets too warm. Um, 
I think the high tomorrow is supposed to be about 92. So, um, try to get that out before it gets too terribly bad, even though where I'm at, the humidity is going to get you anyway. But, um, but y'all let me know what y'all think about that monstrosity of a trimmer, uh, brush cutter, and, uh, Ray, you need something like that to go along with uh, your arsenal with the Bobcat for clearing up some stuff that the Bobcat won't get too close to. Might be a good idea. Uh, so shout out to Ray Ray uh, over uh, Ray Ray's Lawn and Landscape. Uh, he's uh, he's had his hands full lately, I think, like a lot of us. So, um, But I know he's going to grind it out. And uh, I want to send uh, well wishes to... Uh, Mr. Gerald over at Clean and Green Lawn Service. And uh, he's just got back from his cruise. He was on a vacation and I think he had tested positive for COVID. So he's kind of been cooped up in the house and stuff for a little while. And I know he's uh, yeah, he's, he's going kind of stir crazy, I think. So I want to send uh, some well wishes out to Mr. Gerald and uh, hopefully he's recovering pretty good from now i think he was trying to do a live last night and uh kind of kept buffering out and uh don't know how well it worked and uh, i think i uh ended up falling asleep before it got worked out if he came back across it so <laughs> but uh hope you're doing doing all right mr gerald so you know, y'all check them them out uh, again that's american lawn specialist uh ray ray's lawn and landscape and clean the green lawn service um Thank y'all again. If y'all haven't had the opportunity yet, hit that uh, subscribe button down at the bottom. And um, leave me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video, the content. And uh, comment, let me know what your thoughts are on the brush cutter and uh, even in the previous video. So um, the stuff that was going on there, you can comment on that video or follow up with it here. So check that out. And again, y'all be safe, be kind. Be blessed. I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks, everybody.